Hi, it's me again with Corel Roll Tips and Tricks, and I don't totally understand what he, the person's asking because he's already got it done. But he's asking how how you could reproduce this. So I don't know if he means to put a name in here or not. So we're just going to take this and we're going to put it about where it is in the other drawing. And then I'm going to set my nudge factor on two inches. And I'm going to nudge this guy down. Now this is all grouped together. For a minute, just a minute, I'm going to go to object, group, and ungroup. Then I can make a boundary, and I'm going to move the boundary down. And what the boundary did is the exact copy of it, with the exception that we don't have the inner parts of the rifle and the dog's legs. So we just have the outline. Now I'm going to take this item and go up to effects and contour. I'm going to contour to the outside just 0.02. Just made a little bit of a contour. I'm going to go to object and break contour apart. I'm going to grab the center. I'm going to nudge it over because this is the larger version. And I'm going to nudge it up. And because I've nudged, everything's going to be the same. So this is pretty easy. Just take your smart fill tool. I'm using green and I'm just going to nudge everything up. And what that's doing is making an outline of that item. And I think, well, we need one more little spot right in there. Now we can actually take all that. We need to nudge it up a little higher. Now let's, well, what we can do over here, we can left click, right click, and then take our graphic and bring it in. And you'll be able to see the little bit of the contour all the way around that, the item. Uh, so it's actually broken apart. So this would actually engrave. Let's make it uh, all black now. Go to RGB and hit black. And then let's fill in everything in black. And you see that there's a outline around everything in the W. Maybe you could have filled in that part right there, but that's neither here nor there. That's how I would do it. And if he needed, he'll let me know when I email him back if he's wanting a name put in here or not really 100% sure I understand. Pretty neat graphic. Hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.